Today we are going to make a 3D paper sculpture. You will need one sheet of paper for the bottom of the sculpture and about 10 strips of paper. You can create your own strips if you need to. All you need to do is take a sheet of paper and cut strips like this. You will also need tape or glue and scissors if you have them. If you do not have scissors, that's okay. Before we begin, I want you to look at these examples of other paper sculptures. These can give you an idea of some of the possibilities. Now I am going to show you a couple techniques you can use to make your paper sculpture. One of the most important things that we need to do is to make a foot for our paper strips. You can do this by folding down a small piece of the strip on the ends and pinching it down. This is super important because this is where we will add glue to make our paper stand up. Go ahead and try this now. Once you're ready, you're going to add glue to the end of one of the feet and then you're going to put that foot right on to the paper and you want to hold it for at least five seconds. You want to hold it long enough so it, it doesn't come apart. Now you're going to put glue on the other part and you're going to adjust it to where you want it. You can put it really anywhere that you want. Um, you might want to play around for a minute and find where you want it and then you're going to hold it down for five seconds again. Okay, now we're ready for the next strip. Remember the first thing you want to do is to make a foot for both ends. Alright, now you're ready to add your next piece. You want to go ahead and add some glue and place the foot somewhere. Hold down for five seconds. And now you can really place the other end anywhere you want. You can do it on top of the other paper over top, underneath. You can even twist your paper and kind of make a, a loop de line and then glue down. Really you can do anything you want here. So go ahead and try to do a couple things and see what you like best. The next technique I am going to show you is how to make a zigzag line with your paper strip. Start by bending the edges like before. Now you can fold the paper back and forth until it makes a zigzag line. So you fold it one way and then the opposite way. You keep doing this until the whole paper strip is folded. You unfold it and it will be a zigzag line. I am going to show you one more technique. You do not have to use this technique, it's just a really fun one. This is called the tab method. On this, you do not have to make bends right away. Instead, you're going to cut a small piece of your strip. Only cut about halfway into the strip so you do not cut it in half. Cut a few pieces down the strip and then you're going to fold each tab. The first tab will be folded in one direction and then the next tab is folded in the opposite direction. Keep doing this until you have completed 
um, all the bins on the tab. Once you are finished, you will just add glue on the bottom of the tab and it will actually be, be glued closer to the bottom so it's only going to stand up just a little bit. There are so many more ways to fold and cut your paper. Here are a few if you want to try. Be creative and add anything you like. My only rule is that I want you to have at least eight strips glued to your sculpture. You can add many more than that. Have fun and I can't wait to see what you make.